What's up guys, how you going? So, I've been pulling my UPS apart. Got the batteries out of it today, they're all great, in great form. But what turned up in the mail this afternoon is even better. This is a little DC to DC boost converter. It's meant to be between 10 and um, 10 and 28 volts in and up to 32 volts out, fully adjustable. There's a little pot down here. Which you can adjust the yeah, voltage on. Then the multimeter set up, what we'll do is we'll put the multimeter on the output. We've got a 24 volt 70 watt halogen light here. We've got two little uh, 6 or 9 amp hour. I can't remember, I think the 9 amp hour. 9 amp hour or uh, see the acids here. So what we'll do is we'll connect up positive lead wow I think the voltage is a bit high actually <coughs> yeah but voltage might be a bit high that's right it shouldn't blow the globe we'll be right for now let's just fire it up okay and voltage check on the output it's a bright work light I've only ever put 12 volts into it 27 right let's turn it down a bit I'll hold the camera up a bit so you can see it get turned down maybe screwdriver's too big Look at the light, and now I'll dull it off. I'm just turning that little pot on the board here. draw on that, we'll have, we'll have to play with that. See what we can, well, I suppose it's going to be close to double, isn't it? It's smack bang on 24 volts. So it's quite simple the way I've got it wired up. I've just got these two 6 volt seal lead acids in series. There's your negative coming to the boost converter, there's your positive. Loop to make them 12 volts. And it's pushing out 24 comfortably at 70 watts a little bit of heat on the two heat sinks there but that's that's pushing it out quite happily just do before anyone says hey you got the rest of them batteries connected nah they're just all sitting there I'll uh, get a voltage measure so you can see it on the multi Yep. So we'll go on the battery source. Twelve point one. And on the output. Dead twenty four at the moment. This little board was six dollars and two dollars plastic. How cool is that? It's meant to be up to 150, um, 150 watts load. I'm not sure if it would do that. It's doing 70 quite comfortably. It's not getting hot. It is reasonably warm in the room I'm in at the moment. But yeah, it's pretty cool. I thought I'd share. Now, what I will play with next is uh, 
off that 3S bank there. Um, the 18650 bank using it to boost that up to a higher voltage to you know maybe charge e-bike battery or putting two of these together and using them to charge a 48 volt e-bike battery you play with something like that even to power a PWM controller to charge big seal lead acids off a bank like that I was originally trying I bought it that long ago, I forgot what the uh, minimum input voltage was. I was trying to charge it off this single 1S pack, which is just uh, 60, 18650s altogether. But um, yeah, awesome news for the sealed lead acids I just pulled out of this pack. Um, what's 70 amps? 70 amps is, oh, I mean 70 watts. 100 watts at 12 volts is 12 amps. So, um, so maybe around 8 amps, I guess. Um, rough numbers in the head. Pulling 8 amps out of them and they were holding 12 volts. That's a big win. But yeah. Don't be scared to buy the, some of these little cheap circuit boards that are pre made. That's ridiculous. I'll just dial that light off so I can show you. One thing that's not that awesome is the size of that pot. Pot's a potentiometer, if you don't know what I'm talking about. And it won't go down below the input voltage. Input voltage is the minimum. So, for instance, if I wanted to run it like that, it's really dull. It doesn't have much punch. Let's have a look at the, uh, so the multimeter reckons now. I'm going to say it's like 14 volts, maybe 12. Oh, 13.7. That's a good guess. Yeah, thought I'd share. Thanks heaps for watching, guys. Um, I'll make a video soon about uh, pulling the UPS apart so we can have a look at what's actually inside one of these big beasts. Because I don't actually know. Got to be a bit going on, They're quite a serious unit. And yeah, all the rest of the normal stuff will keep on coming. Thanks for watching. I bought that off Gig, which is uh, app powered by Wish. And, uh, They wouldn't even be, yeah, 35 degrees, I don't reckon. Pretty good still. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.